This video provides you with an opportunity to practice your stochastic calculus. Now assume the stock market follows a geometric Brownian motion. That says ds over s equals mu dt plus sigma db, with mu and sigma being constants and b being a Brownian motion. Also assume the risk-free rate r is constant. Now assume that an investor invests a constant fraction of his wealth, pi, into the stock market and the rest, 1 minus pi, into the risk-free rate. Let w denote the investor's wealth process. Hence his wealth is going to evolve as follows, which tells you that the change in wealth equals wealth at the beginning of the trading period times 1 minus pi risk-free rate plus the fraction of pi of his wealth gets invested in the stock market. So there he earns ds over s. Now task A. Derive an explicit formula for wt. Here's the hint. The wealth process will also follow a geometric Brownian motion. Task B. Determine the conditional expectation of wealth to the power 1 minus gamma for a constant relative risk aversion coefficient of gamma. Here's the hint. You can rewrite w to the power of 1 minus gamma as the exponential of 1 minus gamma times the log of wealth. Task C. Consider a constant relative risk aversion investor who wants to maximize his expected terminal wealth. Now mathematically it means he wants to maximize the expectation of 1 divided by 1 minus gamma times w t to the power of 1 minus gamma. Now show that the optimal portfolio rule for that CRRA investor is the same than for a Markowitz investor. Meaning, pi has to equal mu minus r over sigma times 1 over gamma times sigma.